Hello, all my wonderful mystic friends. Welcome to your mystic affirmations for Monday, June 15th, 2020. Many blessings to you all. I hope everyone's doing very well. If you'd like a private reading, please visit my website, royalmystic.com. I'll be more than happy to assist you once you schedule your appointment. If you'd like to see a zodiac reading with your horoscope signs, Please scroll down below the video, you'll see my eye icon. If you'll click the eye icon, it'll take you right to my home page and you'll be able to view all the latest uploads. I even have them categorized in the zodiac sign and in the month they were, they were posted and what, what the reading energy is for. Don't forget, the annual readings are still out there. You guys can check those out and see what your year has, has gone through so far and what's looking for, what, you know, what's to look out for in the future. I also have weekly readings and daily, uh, the daily affirmations here. All the rest are posted there too. And you can be a Mystic member. The Mystic membership uh, brings you to a place where you can do daily Mystic readings and meditations, which are just a little bit different vibe. So check it out, enjoy it, peruse it, and I'll be happy to see you join as a member or book a reading with me. And here we go with all of that. <laughs> Thank you, angels, archangels, divine pure white light, divine spirit, spirit guides, gods and goddesses. Thank you so much for being present here to allow everyone to have the information they seek to assist them in remaining on their highest possible spiritual path. We thank you so much, divine, for these blessings and beautiful messages, and we receive them in the love and light they are intended. We thank you for this divine guidance as always, and we welcome this blessed reading. Thank you so much for being present here. Okay, this one was on the bottom, and this one was on the top. So we'll have one, two. For those of you who are my vibe tribers, my wonderful mystic tribe people, this is the energy for um, Monday, but don't forget Saturday we are doing the solstice activation reading to help bring in your um, your chakra energies and clear them uh, we all need some listen housekeeping with the with the energy right now uh, is kind of essential so if you want to be part of that I have a video out kind of explaining what it is you can check that out and see what to do to be put on the fast track so we have the energy of the Knight of Wands. Knight of Wands is normally in the standard tarot on horseback, very fast moving energy. It is the wand, so it means action, taking action, or the need to take action, being, being approached in a very um, movement oriented way. It can mean getting work information or uh, being able to actually move forward when you have been able to do so in a while. You might have been in a place of being kind of stuck or feel like you have to wait. So this is, things are starting to move here. This Knight of Wands, very fast fire sign energy. Aries, Leo, Sag. We have the Faith card as our top card here. I have faith that I can manifest the wealth and prosperity that I desire. Absolutely. That is what this whole purpose of this reading is for. To, to shore up your faith. All my wonderful friends out there. You guys are so awesome. Thank you for all the help uh, during my practice sessions with uh, trying to get my YouTube live skills advanced enough to where we can do this without any faux pas. We have the flow energy. We're going to speak that out there. This is all going to flow smoothly, perfectly. Riches flow into my life in many ways and from many directions. This is also a, a phrase I use, just a little tweak to it is, I receive abundance from sources known and unknown. This is the, that, that same energy, but the flow is always good. When you're connected to the flow, you have creative energy going. Wow. You may even be in a place of um, manifesting something. That is the flow, being, being in contact and connection. Get more information. Now, sometimes we don't realize that the information doesn't have to be something we seek out. As long as we open ourselves to it, the universe will provide it. So, sometimes we have to sit down and just allow ourselves to attract it. This is the Merkaba energy behind the angel's head. And there's a Merkaba here that's doing the rainbow light, if you can see that. These are beautiful energies. If you'd like to know the name of any of the decks I'm using, please scroll down. You'll see all the description on how to get a reading and just keep scrolling. And then you'll finally see where it says the affirmation decks used are 
as follows and you'll see them all this is the sacred geometry deck here sacred geometry activation change we have the frequency of change supports our ability to gracefully dance in the forever changing nature of reality both inward and outward so that we can appreciate the sweet release of the old and the birth of the new absolutely beautiful energy you've got a square here multiple square energies and then circular energies and many other little orbs and beautiful energy so we receive that change is inevitable that's death taxes and change <laughs> those are the, the life the life promises that will nothing sure in life death ta death taxes and change so we have my life is a mirror now when I first got this when I started reading these cards I didn't understand what it meant because I thought well that's not how I see my life right um, but what it is is the people in my life are really mirrors of me this is what it's saying this affords me the opportunity to grow and change it's it's reflecting back to you the energy energy you're sending off so if you're not getting something that you want to to happen or if you feel like you're keep running into the same obstacle or something keeps jumping in the way you've got to investigate your inner energy go in go inward and see what fears what blocks you have what resistant um, what resistant energy you have towards certain things and see uh, where you can remove that so that you can move forward my life is a mirror and let's see what our shuffled card is for the day I love my body I create peacefulness in my mind and my body reflects this peacefulness as perfect health I think we had this one last weekend I love my body I create peacefulness in my mind and my body reflects this peacefulness as perfect health so this is a release of stress and allowing yourself to be in a place of receiving your best possible health and um, healing body peacefulness is the key so we have the five of wands as our first card these two fell out so the five of wands is conflict or feeling um, an energy of blockage or something that this what the, we were talking about earlier about what if you don't like what you see in front of you um, then we have to go inward and reflect on what's what's got us a snag here what's what's causing the block now this is the whole purpose why I'm doing the chakra cleansing on the solstice because these kind of blocks can be um, invisible to you they're energy blocks uh, you can feel them but you can't really pinpoint them or see them and, and they may be a just a, a conglomeration of sludge energy from things that you've gone through traumatic events or just um, old hurts and pains that have just kind of crumbled and dissolved but they're still sitting there in, in a mass so we want to break those free and and break them down into small digestible little tiny pieces of sand and let them flow get them out of our bodies so this is that energy blockage here and the nine of cups hearts desire being granted very beautiful energy moving forward your hearts desire being granted this is the universe saying yes to opening all the channels that that you need to be open so that you can make progress and have what it is that your heart is desiring this is a card of happiness joy and contentment and the magician the master manifester very good energy here once we get these blocks out everything starts to flow magically beautifully open and the creative energies just pour forth the magician is the ability to manifest your future through your concentrated stillness and mindful thinking so this is a really good card for Monday I hope you all have a really good reading for Monday all the cards seem to match and sing along I hope you all have a wonderful day I send you much love and light I'll see you again tomorrow namaste my friends